welcome to the plastic product design product in the previous videos we already discussed about the different domains in automobile now in this video we'll discuss the detail plastic manufacturing process and injection molding so content for today's video introduction to the plastic introduction to the plastic materials introduction to the injection molding mold construction parting surface feeding channel cooling channel ejection venting cycle time and stages of mold designing also we'll discuss about the concept of slider and lifter today we will discuss a detailed introduction to the plastic what is the plastic why plastic is used in automobile its advantages disadvantages and different materials in a plastic so as we know that plastic is the key to the future light weightening in automobile it is very difficult to realize how important of a plastic have become to our everyday lives we totally surrounded by the plastic components around us as example chairs then pots then good boxes then kitchen equipments paints then uh, your toys material then such different materials uh, and the equipments are made up of a plastic around us you are going to understand the plastic you are going to have to learn a lot of new terms let's see the definition of a plastic plastic are the synthetic polymer of a high molecular weight simply plastic are the material which melts when heat is applied and solidify when heat is removed generally the melting point of a plastic material is lies between 180 degrees celsius to the 300 degrees celsius the process of a manufacturing of the plastic component are known as a molding let's see the types of a plastic plastic are classified into the two types thermoplastic and thermosetting plastic the thermoplastics the thermoplastic are the are the plastic material which melts when heat is applied and solidify on cooling again heat is applied then it melts and solidifies on cooling so thermoplastic is nothing but a cyclic process or we can say the the material which obeys the cyclic process it means the thermoplastic can be reused or we can say the thermoplastic is heat molded uh let's see the thermoplastics uh, material examples uh, the ldp low density polyethylene then hdp high density polyethylene and pp polypropylene then polyamide abs that is that is the acyl acylonitrile butadiene sterling polystyrene then pvc the polyvinyl chloride thermosetting plastic so thermosetting plastic it's similar to the thermoplastic but it cannot be reused let's see the definition the thermoplastic is the plastic material which melts when heat and pressure is applied on melting a chemical reaction takes place and further application of a heat and pressure it take the shape and solidify once the solidification takes place it cannot be remolded that is it cannot be reused for examples uh, thermo thermosetting plastic are th aldehyde melamine backlight such are such materials are under the category of a thermosetting plastic okay. to produce and design a more economical vehicle it is most important to reduce the weight of your automobile and that's why the plastic material and its use is rapidly increasing in automobile industry let's see the advantages of a plastic first one that is low in a weight less density next one easily available so plastic material is easily avail available and some of a plastic material can be reused that's why the availability is going to be increased then can be easily molded whatever the new uh, whatever the new shapes and design and uh, style is going to be introduced in automobile that become somewhat critical to manufacture but due to the use of a plastic it is very easy to produce as it has a property easily molded next one ideal for mass production 
critical shapes and design can be possible next advantage that is the good surface finishing so for plastic there is no need of a set secondary uh, finishing operation so uh, if we compare uh, surface finishing of a plastic material with other uh, stainless steel or a aluminum material then for uh, other materials there is a need of a, uh, a different operations to get a final finishing product but for the plastic material once it is ejected from your mold uh, then it is nothing but the final product next one that is the component in a different color can be molded uh next one that can be recycled or we can say uh, only thermoplastic uh, is going to be reused or recyclable uh, plastic materials use of a plastic is very economical and it is also durable